Hey everybody, welcome back to the medium. We are in the hospital now. We had a flash back to the massacre when we inspected these clothes here. And it looks as if the hospital is massive, both from the outside and from the inside. We need to try and find this Thomas that contacted us on the phone. And I mean... Hello? He could be anywhere. Anyone? Thomas? You there? The duckling. There's these weird books that are strewn about, and I'm not sure if it's just for flavor or what. Maybe referencing certain things. The Polish legends, the dragon of Wawel Hill. Why do my teeth fall out? Back to school, puzzles and crosswords. It's every kid's favorite book, clearly. The duckling. I'll tell Niwa floor plan. Okay, here we are. So we might have to, we might have to reference this at some point. Uh, hotel main entrance, lobby, reception, elevators, pool, sauna, and day room. Okay. So that day room is what we walked over to, to before. See that light flickering in the background there? Can we get out from behind here? Sinners be damned. I am a cat and I licking, liking my balls. <laughs> Bottom left. I don't know why my eyes go directly to that. Uh, vote for Pedro. Where is Mike something? I feel so pathetic and ugly. But I think the main message here is sinners be damned. With the subtext of I am cat and I liking my balls. So... We'll keep an eye out for the cat. Vivian, the Niwa Workers Resort. Man. Okay, we're finding a ton of these postcards. Now it says, I just noticed now it says groundskeeper's postcards. So F is maybe the groundskeeper. My dearest, I know I promised to visit, but I guess... But guess what? I got promoted. Yes, really. Meet the new chief of staff. Yeah, okay. Really think this might be it. A fresh start, a place to call home. For us, I mean. You, me, the kids. I know it sounds crazy, but just think about it. Yours forever. And this was built, based on the sign that we read outside, this was built as kind of like a family fun center where everyone could come and relax and have a good time. Things didn't quite go as planned, it seems. Oh, no. No, no, no. <gasps> Whoa. Hello? Thomas? What? Easy, Marianne. It's just a good old-fashioned haunted hotel. Yeah. Calm your ass down and answer the bell. What's interesting is that even with all the times that we've apparently communicated with the dead, guide them to the next place, whatever, um, we still get spooked. It's the bell. What are you trying to tell us? <laughs> She's back. Pretty cheerful to me. Well, it's what I remember. Um, my friends used to call me by a different name. 
but well, I don't remember what it was. Your friends. Oh, yeah. I used to have a lot of friends here. <laughs> uh, but, but they're all gone now. Did something happen to them? Mm, uh, well, uh, I, I don't really want to talk about it. That, that's okay. So, do you live here? All by yourself? <laughs> you wouldn't believe how boring it gets sometimes. I can imagine. This place must have been... Oh, yes. So busy. People coming and going all the time. <laughs> Always someone to play with. Must have been nice. It was. Not anymore. So. Tell me. What happened? Uh, I remember. People stopped coming. Uh, only a few of them stayed. But they became very sad very angry. They might hurt you. <laughs> Thanks. But I can take care of myself. Hey, I was wondering, have you seen... Mary Ann? <laughs> oh. Yes. Uh, would you play with me? Just for a little while. It, it, it's been so long since I played with anyone. Oh, okay, okay. But I need your help first. Yes! A anything, Marianne! I'm looking for a man. Thomas. Do you know him? Uh, let me think. Uh, I've heard that name before. Uh, some... Take your time. Uh, oh, yeah. The second floor. We can look there. Come on. Hurry, oh, Wait. Well, I don't exactly... I can't go that way. Yeah. So this is where it's interesting. Get up there somehow. Where we have the floor in the spirit world. We don't have it in the material world. Uh, I'm noticing a lot of that texture popping. I'm going to see if I can fix that with one thing here. I'm curious to see if it's ray tracing causing that. No, it doesn't seem like it. Might just be a weird issue with this area. Oh, I see. Okay, so she gets blocked by this. By some type of force. Let's check this locked gate. Up here. Yeah, okay. We have like a bunch of cigarettes. This is where we found the postcard. Oh, what's this? Hey, an elevator. Might as well see if it works. And it does. Sadness. I wished I knew her real name. Press and hold B for an out-of-body experience? Let go. What? Whoa, okay. So we need to try and power this. Gotta move fast. An out-of-body experience. It's like taking a plunge into nothingness. Stay under for too long and it just pulls you in. I wonder though why we couldn't do this when we were at those stairs. Like have this out of body to go freely in this world. A 
Okay, Marianne. Now get your ghostly ass back and power up that elevator. See how we're kind of like falling apart here? Oh, we can just return to the body. <gasps> cool. <laughs> Okay, so now we have to like, oh, we can do it again. Yeah. There's the generator. Uh-huh. <laughs> this is going to be really interesting once things open up and it's like, hey, just figure this out on your own. Okay, so I think I fixed the flickering textures just by switching it to 30 FPS. I'm playing this on pre-release, so hopefully that gets uh, sorted out and we can switch it back, but it's much better, much less distracting now. Okay, so we are in the second, the first floor? Oh, hold on. I guess we didn't make it all the way. Let's just see if there's anything going on here. Yeah, see, she's got... Okay, so we're overlooking here. And we have access to the stairs in the other world, it looks like. The art of internationally acclaimed painter Richard Tarkovsky for the first time in the Niwa Resort. Now, that door that was locked before. Is gone. Friends forever. Hey, yeah. I don't know, that's unsettling for some reason. Any little kid drawings are always a bit bizarre. Doesn't seem to be anything else going on down here. Can we do anything behind the desk? Hmm. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, doesn't look like we're going anywhere here. This is blocked because she doesn't have the stairs. And... It's a bit weird to get your head around in the sense that if you have the split view, you're blocked in certain aspects. If you have your material view only, you're blocked in certain aspects. And if you have your, your otherworldly view, you're blocked in certain aspects. Okay. Now where did she go? All right. So meetings rooms, manager's office, and elevators. Whoa. Huh. What is that? <gasps> what the? That's likely where we need to go. <laughs> as much as I don't want to. What else is here? Nothing. Okay. What? So we have access over here. Okay. Not getting through here. Now, I wonder if items can be used between worlds. If I go, if I go out of world here, nothing changes. We need to find something. Uh, what? Summon your spirit shield. Whoa. Holy shit. <laughs> cool. I didn't even know I could do that. 
So that tells us we're still learning powers. Based on, like, instinct, basically. Nice. Oh, there we go. An odd key. I would say so. Sadness? I'm just using our insight there to see if anything happens in this other world. I do want to continue down to the end of the hallway at least and see what might be here. Look at all the blood. Oh yeah. Is that skin? Oh my god. I think it is skin. We're gonna have to like cut it open at some point, I think. Okay. So we've got insight, we've got out-of-body experience, we have the spirit shield. And then that opens and that that shield block is gone now too. <laughs> this is going to I imagine this might get pretty complex. Uh and solving some of the puzzles can maybe get pretty difficult. got the phone we can maybe feel the aura yes I'm working on it yes I know I just yes I understand just give me some time a few days you'll get what you want Ugh, that voice I don't know why, but it gives me shivers. Now, I wonder if that's the same guy that brought us here. I think it's the same voice that we heard outside that was sent here to do something. Some type of, uh, let's say, a mission, for lack of a better term. And then now we're hearing, like, an update. So we're following this story somehow for some reason. Looks like the only way. Great drop down here. Okay. I'm not that keen it on finding out, to be honest. Cold. Memories of grief. Loneliness. Use insight to gain anything there? I don't think so. There's something to put in here, apparently. And on this side. What the? The spark's too weak to absorb. Oh. It's like it's missing something. Okay, so that's one of those, um, like, power shrines. An old prescription. I know these drugs all too well. Ursula, Anna, uh, Hippophysine, and Birspirone. Diagnosed with depression, hysteria, insomnia, malnutrition. Treated with electroshock as they would do back in the... Back in the day. This happened on, in 71. Which means she also struggled with anxiety, depression, etc. Some objects soak up moments from the past. Just squeeze in the right spot and let it pour out. Whoa! Okay, so now in the other world... 
mean? Ah, sunflower weary of time. For my favorite nurse. Oh, Mr. Tarkovsky, you shouldn't have. Please, it's the least I can do for all the good work you do around here. Huh. An actual happy memory. So there's more to this place than just doom and gloom. As with most places, I would imagine. Now, if we interact here... Ah, sunflower weary of <laughs> time. For my favorite nurse. Oh, Mr. Tarkovsky. So we can just replay it. You shouldn't have. Please. It's the least I can do for all the good work you do around here. So many really cool mechanics. Oh, this thing, I, like, this skin, I guess, is... Whoa! Oh, shit. This is falling apart. <sighs> Looks like I'm in for another dive. What the? If only I had something sharp. Yeah, I imagine... We'll get, like, a knife or something. So here's a scenario where... Like, if we only had access on the spirit world, we could have an out-of-body experience. To cross that, I think. What the? Yeah, here we go. Cool. Oh, God, I hate this. Can probably reconstruct this or what's here wow weird i guess we need the physical object to reconstruct is that a bathtub full of blood yep <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh my god. Did not like that. I got a little too comfortable there. Whoa. Okay. 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 My heart beats at like two billion. starting to fade here. So that probably lets us cut that skin, right? Let's just see if there's anything else here quickly. Yeah, I should go back here. Whew. This thing looks strong. Now, I don't know. I don't know what that was. That jumped at us, or maybe who? I don't have a clue. <laughs> I went to my dark place there. Yeah, that was disturbingly satisfying. <laughs> now, can I get back to that area in the in the material world? Here's that pot that we saw. This could be useful. A dried the light up of a memory strong enough to defy this place. A dried up sunflower. There was a memory here. Yeah, okay.
You want me to read you another one, darling? Oh, look at this mess! Don't worry, I'll clean you up in no time. I'm here for you, my love. This man, Tarkovsky, he ended up as her patient? Oh, uh, okay, so that's Tarkovsky again, who is, I, I think he runs the hospital and he was saying Ursula is his favorite nurse. And now he's the patient. Oh God, I guess we're gonna check this bathroom. Is there anything there and, nope. Wow. So here's where we went before we jumped back. You... <laughs> I know you're there. Wish I had the strength to cut you out. You don't deserve to exist. You're nothing. There have been times when I thought about ending it all. But I was too afraid that a part of me would go on, trapped on huh. the other side. Forever. Yeah, your conditions are a little different. Okay, so I wonder if, okay, let's look at her side. Okay, so let's look at the other world here. Focus on material, focus on spirit. Thinking maybe we could put the, um, the thing there, but I guess not. Let's go back out. We can cut that path at the end now. This is where we came in. Oh, what if I put it here? There, and then that's giving this thing power because it's uh, infused with the memories or what yeah. have you. Now it's strong. Cool. <laughs> this is so trippy. Hey, wait. Wasn't there like skin at the end? That's our way in. See, now this is locked, but. This is missing floor, but yeah, okay. Let's go through. Jeez. My heart's still just pounding. 
I love a good jump scare. Don't get me wrong. But. Oh. Wait. What the? Is this? Oh, I see. We were in a different hallway, I think. Just running back here to see. Yeah. Okay. Right. Okay, so we went outside. I see. I see what happened. Gotta find something to cut it with. Well, we got that. What's unique about these powers is that oftentimes if you have something similar in a game, you would have like a cooldown or limited usage or something. It seems like that's not in play. Probably raises a bunch of restrictions. You can do some cool stuff. Whoa, 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 whoa. She just put that down on her own. Reclaiming history. Uh, fire erupts in the sky. Explosions echo across the wilderness. Sparks rain down on the ruins of Fort Pulaski, a once impenetrable fortress that saw some of the most intense fighting during the 1945 offensive against Hitler's forces. This time, however, it was not bombs or mortar fire that lit up the sky. This was spectacular display of fireworks that marks the grand opening of the Niwa Workers Resort. The event that attended or was attended by the leaders of the party, including the first secretary who had his say during the gala. Let this site of victorious struggle against the forces of evil become a place of respite for the working people of the Republic in times of peace and prosperity. Liberated in January 45 by the heroic Red Army, the historical landmark is currently undergoing re renovations and will soon be open to the public at large. The Niwa Workers Resort will welcome its first guests by the end of June. Oh. Manager, huh? Thomas is the manager. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Okay. Sadness. We gotta stop meeting like this. I told you to follow me. I'm trying my best. Take it easy, sad. This place is huge. It's easy to get lost. Just, just stick with me. Okay. I'll stick like a tick. <laughs> <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> this... Thomas Rekovich. All oh, right. Huh. Listen, hon. You yeah, said she see you it. remembered someone named Thomas. Was it Thomas Rekovich? Was he the manager here? I, uh, I guess. You think he stuck around? Uh, I'm not sure. There was an old man here, very recently, I think. Oh. And you think it was Thomas? Oh, I don't know. Old men all look the same, <laughs> all wrinkly and all blah. Hey, that's not very nice. <laughs> <laughs> well, if he's still around... I've got an infestation to report. Marianne! Uh, I feel... Oh, uh, I don't think we should be here. It's okay, Sadness. Look, there's no one... Oh boy. Here. Oh boy. Sadness? Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like Sadness. I don't like little girls that talk like that. I don't like any of it, pretty much. <laughs> Uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Wish me luck.